Hi grade fives, today we are going to do reading, so we're going to do, you're going to listen and then answer the questions afterwards. So our story is Jack and the Beanstalk. We've got no food Jack, says his mother. We've got no money, go and sell the cow. So Jack goes up the road, look says a strange old man, magic beans, give me that cow and you can have them, oh, says Jack, all right, what, shouts Jack's mother, no money, beans, go to bed now, but in the morning there's a beanstalk, tall, 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 and green, 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 oh, says Jack, Wonderful! Magic! Jack climbs out of the window. He climbs up the beanstalk. Up, up, up. Jack comes to a road. He walks and walks. Then he sees a house. A big, big house. And a woman. A big, big woman. Can I have some breakfast? Says Jack. All right, she says. Come in. But listen, my man is a giant. He eats boys, so be quiet. She gives Jack some breakfast. Then there's a noise. Thump, thump, thump. My big man is here, she says. Quick, hide, get in there. Fee, fi, fo, foy. I can smell a little boy, says the big giant. Now you can't says his wife. Wash your hands. Your breakfast is ready. He eats his breakfast. Then he says, Wife, bring me my gold. He puts the gold on the table. One, two, three. The giant goes to sleep. Then Jack comes out quietly. He takes the bag of gold and quietly he runs away. Jack runs back down the long road. He climbs back down the beanstalk and he takes the gold home to his mother. Look, mother, look, he says. Now they live well, but one day there's no more gold. So Jack climbs up the beanstalk again. Up, up, up. He comes to the road again. He walks and walks. He sees the house again, the big, big house. Can I have some breakfast? Jack says. Go away, says the big woman. My big man eats boy and you're a bad boy. You take things, don't you? I don't take things, says Jack. That's another boy. I can tell you his name, but I want some breakfast first. All right, she says. Come in. She gives Jack some breakfast. Then there's a noise. Thump, thump, thump. My big man is here, says the woman. Quick, hide, get in there. Fee, fi, fo, foy. I can smell a little boy, says the giant. Now you can't, says his wife. Wash your hands. Your breakfast is ready. After breakfast, the giant says, wife. Bring me my hen. I want some gold eggs. So she brings the hen to the table. Lay, says the giant. And the hen lays a gold egg. Yes, say the giant. Lay, lay. Then he goes to sleep. He comes to the road again. He walks and walks. He sees the house again. The big, big house. And the woman, the big, big woman. But this time, she doesn't see him. Jack hides behind some books. Soon he hears a noise. Fee, fi, fo, foy. I can smell a little boy, says the giant. Can you? says his wife. Is that bad boy here again? Let's look in here. Perhaps he's hiding. But they can't find Jack. After breakfast, the giant says, Wife, 
bring me my magic harp. She brings it and he says, play harp, play. Then he goes to sleep. Quietly Jack comes out. He takes the magic harp and quietly he runs away. But the harp calls out, giant, giant, the boy is taking me. Then the giant opens his eyes. Help, says Jack. He runs away fast. He runs down the long road. He's taking me, sing the harp. Stop, shouts the giant. Bring back my harp. Jack gets to the beanstalk. Quickly he climbs down, 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 down. Mother, get the axe. Quickly, the big giant is coming. Jack cuts down the beanstalk and the giant falls down. He hits his head on the ground, thump, and he's dead. That's the end of him, says Jack. Now, can I have some breakfast? Okay, so that's the end of our story. Now we have a few exercises. The first one, write the words. There is six sentences. You have to match the words to the sentence. Number two, what do they say? Write the words. Look at the picture and remember back to the story. What did each character say? Remember to do your exercises in your workbook. Number three, Put the words in the correct order. There is four sentences. All the sentences is mixed up. You have to make it right. So a sentence starts with a capital letter and ends with a point, question mark or exclamation mark. Number four. Write the story again, correcting the mistakes in each sentence. Write the paragraph and correct all the mistakes in the sentences. The first ones they did. Jack and his father have no food. No, silly, it's his mother. There is a dictionary for you. You can see the picture and say the words. That's an easy way for you to understand what the words mean. Axe, breakfast, climb, cow, cut down, dead, egg, fall down, giant, gold, harp, Hen, hide, lay, noise, road, runaway, sow, shout, smell, wash, and wife. That's the end. Bye, guys.